Welcome to another YouTube video, everyone. You might notice that I'm dressed for Christmas. Look at my, my fancy Christmas eye makeup and my ridiculous Christmas shirt. You know why? Because it's Christmas. It's not actually. It's, it's like the middle of summer. But I have been commissioned to make a Santa suit, and so I shall. Let me show you these gorgeous materials that I have. I'm actually really excited. This is like a full-ass Victorian Santa suit. Like, this guy wants, like, old-school, like, vest with silver embroidery, armbands, long coat, like the whole business is going to be so exciting. I'm so excited to make this and the materials are just beautiful. Let me show you. All right. So this is what we've collected so far. I have this beautiful, beautiful, thick red upholstery velvet. This is red lining for the suit. I've got some beautiful silver, like glitter trim here. I've got some silver embroidered appliques. I've got these gorgeous silver buttons, which I'm really excited about. This is going to be the Santa bag. Got some silver stuff here to make the Santa bag. Got this beautiful white fur. I've got a few more things to collect, but this is the this is the basics of our Santa suit. And uh, I have to tell you a secret. So the secret is that it's the middle of summer, which I know I already told you. I know, I know I'm not that forgetful yet. But we're going hard at this. It is like 30 fucking degrees outside and we're like, fuck it. We're going to celebrate Christmas because we're making a Santa suit. So Jessica and I, in our little middle, little medieval fort. There we go. Little medieval fort. We brought, check this out. I brought my TV VCR combo with all of these delightful Christmas VHSs. So we're going to watch those at the fort today. I'm dressed for it. Jessica's dressed for it. Look, oh, look at the Christmas vest. Yes, look at extra cute. We've got a Christmas playlist queued up. We've got Christmas beverages, which may or may not include some, uh, you know, alcoholic eggnog. We'll see. And uh, it's going to be a fucking fun day. And if you don't believe us, if you think I'm a lying Canadian and it's always cold here, I'm going to prove it to you. Here we go. Check it out. It's actually summertime. You guys, we're not lying. Go. <laughs> We're just going to dip a toe here into making Santa suits. We're not going to start with the real complicated shit. We're just going to start by making the Santa bag. So I've got the velvet. I took away all the other supplies that don't involve the Santa bag. And I have an old Santa bag here for a size reference. And here we go. <laughs> Right, you guys piece number one the santa bag is done and like look at look at how beautiful look at how absolutely beautiful this is i'm totally totally thrilled with the way this santa bag came out and now we're gonna start on the pants all right you guys here we go we're gonna start the pants got my fabric marker got an old pair of santa pants that i'm gonna use as a mock-up pattern and uh let's do this <laughs> No more sewing, only drinking. This may or may not have booze in it. It's delicious. It's so good. Right? <laughs> Cheers! Merry Christmas, everybody! The pants are done! The pants are done! They're not terribly exciting, but the pants are done. And I'm very pleased about it. So now I'm gonna have some more of my Christmas drink, and I'm gonna start cutting out the hat. Let's go! I mean, let's go, everybody. Merry Christmas! <laughs> So the Santa hat is mostly done. It looks totally, totally awesome. I'm really pleased with that. It just needs a pom-pom. And I got a regular pom-pom and it looked like shit. So we're not going to do that. So I'm going to take this piece of monster fur and I'm going to stuff it. And I'm going to make my own pom-pom, which is going to look a lot less stupid than this when I'm done. Santa hat, done. Extra long, beautiful, plush fur. Now on to, I don't know what, maybe the vest? We'll see. That's tomorrow's problem. Surprise! I lied. I stayed late at work to finish these. These are just the little, the little armbands for him. They turned out super cute. I think they're going to be great. Okay, now more sewing tomorrow. 
Surprise! Welcome to day two of Santa suit making. It's still June, but we can't pretend that it's Christmas anymore because it's June, so it has to be pride. So I did some super fun pride makeup here, and I wore my... This is the most this is the most color that I own on this jacket. So we've gone from Christmas to pride in one day, and we're being guest joined by Brody. Say hi, Brody. Also in his beautiful pride makeup. He's my uh, motivational mascot person while I sew today, I guess. Anyway, time to get started on the vest. Let's go! Clearly the vest is not done. It still has some raw edges and stuff, but it's it's going it's going good. I'm pleased with my my insert welt pockets, which are real pockets because we're gonna get Santa a pocket watch and stuff. Um, got the lining. It's also not done yet, but uh, we gotta wait for him to come for a fitting for that. I've also got these beautiful silver scroll appliques, which I'm thinking about putting up there. But I'm gonna ask him. He might want them down here. I don't know. He might want them like down here. We'll have to see. So Santa's going to come for a fitting on that. But in the meantime, I'm going to start cutting out the coat. Go! All right, the Santa suit coat is cut out now. It is all these pieces. That's... I don't know, I think the front, that's the back, that's the sleeves, and that's extra fur because I probably fucking need it and I don't know why. There's also a zipper around here somewhere. So time to start sewing this together! <laughs> Alright, so Santa came for his first fitting on the vest and the coat and everything else, but the vest and the coat are the only things that aren't done, like the pants and the hat and everything went swimmingly, which is great. These also went swimmingly. He didn't want to change a damn thing, which makes me really excited. So now I can continue with this pile of stuff that is not yet sewn on and some beautiful Santa buttons, and off we go. <laughs> coat is done. I finished it and it's it's fucking glorious. I can't seem to fit it on this table because it's a really big coat but like ah oh, the fur is so nice and plush. Has a hidden zipper in here so you can get it done up and then I put domes in here. There's some domes that I can't seem to open. There's domes in there to hold it closed so that the fur hides the zipper completely and it looks fucking amazing. <sighs> now to finish the vest. And the vest is done. The vest is done. Are you excited? Oh my God, it looks so beautiful. So obviously Santa chose to have his uh, appliques down here instead of up here, but I think that it looks equally good. And I made this very cool um, chain. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it's actually a glittery, there we go. A glittery chain with a pocket watch at the end of it in the pocket here, which is beautiful. Got the buttons all on it and everything. I'm fucking excited about it. So the very last thing is to make the belt. And I got some thick ass belt making leather. So let's get to it. All right, you guys, the belt is done. It's very long, obviously, because it's a Santa belt. So I can't really display it correctly on the table. But uh, my dad actually made him this, this custom belt buckle. We couldn't get one big enough. So my dad like fucking welded this really cool like, he's not, I mean, he is a welder, but more for, like, cars, not for, like, decorative shit. So I think he did a really good job. And then I took it to an engraving place and got it engraved with SC because he told me that all real Santas have SC on their belt buckle. And that's how you know that they're the real Santa. So he had to have that. So made the keeper, riveted it together. I did some lacing here in the back for extra adjustability, which is going to be nice if he gains or loses weight. Um, and then we got our, our belt holes, you know, down here. Not not terribly exciting. But uh, yeah, that's it. That's the full damn Santa suit. Let me show you the whole thing. Ta-da! Santa suit start to finish. This table is even big enough. I need a longer fucking table for this Santa suit. Oh, my God. So Santa bag. 
Santa hat, Santa arm garters, beautiful vest that I just showed you. These are the Santa pants, but I had to fold them up. Those are the Santa pants. And then Santa coat with the SC belt buckle. Oh my God, I'm so proud of this. This is this looks amazing. I'm so happy for him. And for me, I'm glad it's done. So Santa promised us a footage of him wearing this. So that's the next thing you're gonna see. Merry Christmas, ho, ho, ho! Hello, Missy. It's Santa Claus. I just wanted to say thank you so much for this wonderful, wonderful suit. It was a big hit with all the children, and it's a big hit with me. Again, thank you so much. You are amazing. Ho, 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 ho. Oh, 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 the new suit, custom made, oh, feels so good, makes Santa look so slim. Oh, 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 oh. All right, welcome to the end of the Santa suit video. It's now Christmas time again, which is why I'm back in my, my Christmas gear, because it is in fact Christmas time. I built the Santa suit in the summertime, he came and picked it up, and now he wore the Santa suit because it's almost Christmas, which means he has to put on his suit and get to work, delivering his presents to all the good boys and girls and everybody in between all around the world. So you know if you've been good? He's gonna bring you something, which means I might be getting coal in my stocking. I don't know. I don't know. I've been pretty good this year, but we'll see. We'll see. So I hope you liked Santa in his suit. I think he looks amazing. Uh, we found out two things. Number one, I can sew better than he can. And number two, he can hoe better than I can. That's right. You heard me. Ho, 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 of course. Get your mind out of the gutter, everybody. And I hope you liked coming along on this journey with me. And if you did, if you could give this video a thumbs up, that'd be amazing. If you want to subscribe to my channel, that'd be even more amazing. That'd be a good Christmas gift to me if you want to subscribe if you haven't yet. If you want to follow me on any of the things, I have all of them. Jessica's going to link them below. Uh, I also have Kofi. If you want to buy me a Kofi, ko-fi.com slash Um, And I think that's it. Like, subscribe, follow me on all the things. Buy me a Kofi if you want to. Merry Christmas, everybody. And you're going to say it with me one time. Are you ready? Can you see my jacket? That's right. Hail Santa.